Hello, everybody. This is Jason Goodson with Gardening with Goody. This is day 26 of the 30 day vlog challenge. All right, this time we're going to walk through the garden real fast and just kind of give you an overlook of what's going on. This is where I just planted the cantaloupe right here. And as you can see, right next to it's a Swiss chard. This, these are the volunteers, the green beans I was talking about earlier. Right here, they just popped up out of nowhere into these spots right here. And I have a few in random spots like right there. This is the watermelon we have planted this year. Once again, we love watermelon. We have okra that is growing right here. It's a small row of okra, so we'll maybe plant something else on the other side. Some of the seeds didn't take. And again, I'm not saying that God hasn't prepared this okra because I thought, like I said last year, that these green beans were doomed. But I guarantee you, God had a different plan and he's growing and we are happy to have them. These potato plants are looking good. I got to cover them up again one more time. One more time so we can get in there and get some good potato production out of here. But they'll tell you what, these wood chips, they do wonders for the garden. We love them. Um, you know, we got to work on getting some of this grass out of here. So it still grows pretty, pretty heavy. But uh, this Bahia grass is quite evasive and it grows pretty quickly. It's good for the animals. And here's a great row of okra, the spineless okra. And look forward to having a lot of my crops from the okra this year. And here is our plants here that we're talking about. The green beans are growing. I got to get these tied back up to the trellis here. The corn is starting to sprout. And the great thing about corn is it'll sprout next to one another. We've already got some ears growing here. Speaking of, this was a <laughs> an interesting find for me. But here, this little plant right here, tomato plant was a sucker i've never planted a sucker before i didn't know what to take and there it is we planted it deep and it's growing like crazy right now gotta get these ants off of the uh off the plants here but we'll come through here take care of it but they're starting to grow we got some ears starting to form and that's a great sign for the garden this side of the garden, of course, is our hot peppers. We've got several varieties of hot peppers growing through here. And on this side of the raised bed, of course, is our tomatoes. We have big boy tomatoes and we have Cherokee purple in here growing as well. And looking forward to seeing the fruits and the benefit. We got a granddaddy one down here. I don't know if we can get a good view of it or not, but it's a it's a big old boy down there. Let's see if I can get down there and show it to you. It's going to be hard to see and get focused on it, but it's a pretty big old guy down there. Growing, and I got to do some pruning around these tomatoes as well so they'll grow thicker and fuller. And as I get time, I'll get out here and make sure that happens. But the calzone has definitely started working in here, and it's sprouted up like crazy. <laughs> 